Hallelujah. Glory be to the name of the Lord for another beautiful day. We bless the name of the Lord for the 25th day of the month of October, year 2022. Glory be to the name of the Lord for all that he has done and all that he will continue to do. Beloved, I want you to appreciate the Lord for his mercies, for his loving kindness, for his mighty name. Bless his name, give him glory, give him honor, give him adoration. Father, you are worthy of all praise. You are worthy to be worshipped, you are worthy to be adored. There is no one like you, there is no one to be compared with you. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' name we pray. Beloved, this is High Voltage Prayer Program. And if you are joining this program for the first time, God bless you. The Lord will lift you up. The Lord will fight for you. This program is a program to develop your prayer muscle. It's a program for you to become victorious in the course of your life. It's a program for you to operate at a high ladder. It's a program for you to become a champion and a giant in the Lord. It's a program for you to become a terrifying figure in the camp of the wicked. And it's a program that will make you to uh, stand tall among your peers. It's a program also that will make you to exercise victory over the wicked enemy. And it's a program that will build up your prayer altar and strengthen your prayer fire. You are welcome to the battle arena. I pray that God will empower you as you wear the garment of a warrior in the name of Jesus Christ. Take any song of praises and bless the Lord with it and glorify the Lord with it. Glory, glory to the Father. Glory, glory to the Son. Glory, glory to the Holy Ghost, hallelujah, praise the Lord, glory, 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 e to the Father, glory, glory, to the Son, glory, Holy Ghost, Alleluia, praise the Lord, thank you Father, aha, beloved, I want you to get ready as we, as we pray together now, each of the prayer we are going to pray today, they are loaded with more breakthrough, just pray them and pray them with power, say every evil aggression against my star, be destroyed by fire in the name of Jesus. Every evil aggression against my star be destroyed by fire in the name of Jesus. Every evil aggression against my star be destroyed by fire in the name of Jesus. Every evil aggression against my star be destroyed by fire in the name of Jesus. Every evil aggression against my star be destroyed by fire in the name of Jesus. Every evil aggression against my star be destroyed by fire in jesus name we pray say any power redirecting my destiny in a wrong way ah in the name of jesus any power redirecting my destiny in a wrong way ah in the name of jesus any power redirecting my destiny in the wrong way ah in jesus name we pray aha uh -huh. wonderful I uh, say every evil hand upon my star wither in the name of Jesus. Every evil hand upon my star wither in the name of Jesus. Every evil hand upon my star wither in the name of Jesus. Every evil hand upon my star wither in the name of Jesus. Every evil hand upon my star wither in Jesus' name we pray. Thank you, Father. Say, blood of Jesus, envelop my life and my household in the name of Jesus. Blood of Jesus, envelop my life and my household in the name of Jesus. Blood of Jesus, envelop my life and my household in the name of Jesus. Blood of Jesus, envelop my life and my household 
in the name of Jesus. Blood of Jesus, envelop my life and my household. In Jesus' name we pray. Say, Holy Ghost fire, overshadow my life and my household. In the name of Jesus, Holy Ghost fire, overshadow my life and my household. In the name of Jesus, Holy Ghost fire, overshadow my life and my household. In the name of Jesus, Holy Ghost fire, overshadow my life and my household. In Jesus' name we pray. Say, every evil imagination against my star be dismantled in the name of Jesus. Every evil imagination against my star be dismantled in the name of Jesus. Every evil imagination against my star be dismantled in the name of Jesus. Every evil imagination against my star be dismantled in Jesus' name we pray. Say every environmental witchcraft assigned to trouble my life scatter unto desolation in the name of Jesus. Every environmental witchcraft assigned to trouble my life scatter unto desolation in the name of Jesus. Every environmental witchcraft assigned to trouble my life scatter unto desolation in the name of Jesus. Every environmental witchcraft assigned to trouble my life scatter unto desolation in the name of Jesus. Every environmental witchcraft assigned to trouble my life scatter unto desolation in the name of Jesus. Every environmental witchcraft assigned to trouble my life scatter unto desolation in Jesus' name we pray. Say every cause and covenant working against my destiny be broken by fire in the name of Jesus. Every cause and covenant working against my destiny be broken by fire in the name of Jesus. Every curse and covenant working against my destiny be broken by fire in Jesus' name. We pray the next prayer. You need to pray this prayer very well. Foundational strong man challenging my destiny at the edge of my breakthrough. Ah, in the name of Jesus. Foundational strong man challenging my destiny at the edge of my breakthrough. Ah. In the name of Jesus, foundational strong man, challenging my destiny at the edge of my breakthrough. Ah, in Jesus' name we pray. I beg you to pray that prayer very well. Two more. Foundational strong man, at the edge of my breakthrough. Uh -huh. Foundational strong man, challenging my life at the edge of my breakthrough. Ah, in the name of Jesus, foundational strong man. Challenging my life at the edge of my breakthrough. Ah, in Jesus' name, pray. Put aggressor, please. The Bible says, right from the days of the John the Baptist, the kingdom of heaven suffered violence, and violent men will take it by force. So, violence is needed to take what belongs to you by force in the realm of the spirit. Foundational strong man. Challenging my destiny, challenging my life at the edge of my breakthrough. Yeah, in the name of Jesus, foundational strong man, challenging my life at the edge of my breakthrough. Yeah, in the name of Jesus, foundational strong man, challenging my destiny at the edge of my breakthrough. You can put destiny, you can put your life. You can put the name of your children. You can say foundational strong man challenging the destiny of my children at the edge of breakthrough. That prayer means that you are closer to breakthrough. A power will just rise up and say no. And everybody who desire to help you will go moot. They will just abandon you. You start again when you have reached the top, everything will collapse. There is a strong man that always wants to waste your effort. So you have to pray very well. Foundational strong man. Aha. 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 Foundational strong man. Challenging my life. At the edge of my breakthrough, ah, in the name of Jesus, foundational strong man, challenging my destiny. At the edge of my breakthrough, ah, in the name of Jesus, foundational strong man, challenging my destiny. At the edge of my of my breakthrough, ah, in Jesus' name, we pray. Pray that prayer again. Say, environmental strong man, 
contending against my life at the point of my miracle ah, in the name of jesus environmental which strong man <laughs> confronting my life at the point of my breakthrough ah, in the name of jesus environmental witchcraft environmental strong man confronting my life at the point of my miracle ah, in the name of jesus environmental strong man confronting my life at the point of my miracle ah, in jesus name we pray take your time to pray this prayer on your own spend quality time and you will see what the lord will do uh by the grace of god yesterday we started a series knowing the secret knowing the secret see the more you pray the more you discover that discover there is knowing the more you pray the more you discover and the more you discover the more you recover the more you recover the more you possess your possession what does that one mean it means that prayers can help you to know the secret and when you know the secret it will be easy for you to recover what has been taken from you and when you recover then you begin to fulfill your destiny secret is important for you to know the secret of your life the secret of your foundation the secret of the root where you came from secret are not easy to be known secrets are not on the surface they are right deep the devil will not allow anyone to know the secret behind the bondage or the battle of his life many people run from pillar to post from mountain to valley and from prophet to prophet today or from abalis to abalis or from one prayer house to another one all what they are looking for a solution they want to know the secret of what they are passing through that's why many people will ask us pastor please for me pray for me what did god tell you do you know the thing they want to know the secret because if the secret of what you are passing through is not known all the prayer you are praying is just like just putting a, you know a spreading a, a bread on the water in a way it will not amount to anything solid so knowing the secret is a pivot very important and that is why the enemy of your soul the devil will not allow you to know that secret and that is why to know the secret you must be able to intensify in prayer life is full of secret life is full of mysteries many people they are shadow of what heaven has created them to be secret is very important for you to know a secret of your existence the secret of your destiny the secret of the battle you have found yourself the secret of your future this is very very important if you pick the uh bible verse or chapter of genesis chapter 37 you will see a young man called joseph god in his uh mercy revealed to joseph the secret of his destiny and when joseph got this secret he did not know how to manage it he did not know how to handle it then he let this secret open to the brothers and the problem of his life started this has been a major problem of many of us listening to me now your secrets were known by your siblings your secrets were known by your enemy and since they could decode into it and they find out that you are going to be great in life they decided they prepare battle for your future they prepare battle, solid battle for your future by putting you into a covenant, by burying you. When you are a baby, you are, you are just growing up as a child, you never knew it, but they have seen it. Many of them have taken you to a place under the guise of protection and they'll be able to extract into your future. This is the major battle that everybody is going through because part of the secret of our life has been made known. See the battle of Joseph, it was severe. If God has not been on the side of Joseph, Joseph would have been wasted. Also, if God has not been on your side, probably today you would have been wasted. Probably today I have been wasted. But God has been on our side. 
Many of us will grow up in the midst of witches. Many of us will grow up in the midst of those who are terrible. But God protected us. Then if God has secured your life, it is time for you now to arise and understand the secret of your moving forward. The Bible says by the time you grow and you gain dominion, you can break the yoke of the enemy over your life. Genesis 27 verse 40, 40 to 41. Understand the mystery of the secret. The secret is important for you to know. The Bible says something very strong in Proverbs chapter 25 verse 2. This is one of my favorite, uh, favorite uh, uh, Bible verses in the Bible. It is the glory of God to conceal a thing. It is the glory of God to conceal a thing. But the honor of kings is to search out matter. It is the honor of you and I to search out the matter. You must know the secret. When you understand the secret, the enemy will hands down. <laughs> When you understand the secret behind your bondage, oh, the body is lifted up. So every secret you discover concerning your problem strengthens you, empowers you, and makes you superior against your oppressor. It makes you a terrifying figure, and your oppressors will, will be afraid. You must understand that. Life will, will not forgive anyone who mortgage his destiny on the altar of spiritual blindness. You must be able to pray every spiritual blindness in my life. Holy Ghost, set it off. Set it away. Wipe away every evil, evil veil so that my eyes can see. Secret. They are mysteries that are hidden from people. Secret. They are cover facts or figures from the opponent. Secret and concealed information intended to keep the victim in blindness and disguise bondage. Secret, there are pieces of information exclusively reserved. So you must get secret. The law must open your eyes to understand the secret behind what you are passing through. You want to take a step now, you must know the secret. One of the major prayers you must be praying when you want to take any step or you want to bring somebody, you want to employ somebody, pray. Oh Lord, show me the secret of this fellow I want to employ. Show me the secret of this fellow that I want to employ. When you pray very well and God see your mind, he show you the secret. There are secrets behind everything. If you are not careful, that fellow you are employing into your house may be the one the enemy will use to make you not to see any secret you need to know. It is time for you to understand. It is fight, time for you to fight aggressively. It is time for you to pray that the Lord Almighty will reveal the secret of what you are passing through. Every bondage has a secret. Every battle has a secret. Every war has a secret. Everything you are going through has a secret. Your destiny has a secret. Your future has a secret. Your family has a secret. It is your duty to ask God to give you divine secret. And when you get this secret, your destiny begins to move forward. The beneficial secret about your life will guide your destiny and give you all around fulfillment. And you will see your destiny speaking out gloriously. It is high time for you to pray. Now, Lord, I need this secret. I need to let me know secret. Knowing the secret, knowing the secret of your destiny, knowing the secret of the battle you are fighting, knowing the secret of the bondage of your life, knowing the secret why things are working like this, knowing the secret why your husband is acting this way, knowing the secret why your children are acting this way, knowing the secret why things are very tough. When you understand the secret, you are good to go. You are going to fight a victorious uh, battle. You are going to get testimony. I pray that the Almighty God will open your understanding and give you deeper understanding of His knowledge in the name of Jesus Christ. Tomorrow we will talk about the purpose of knowing the secret of your problem. The purpose of knowing the secret of your problem. And go deeper into it. Because by the time we'll be exploring it deeper and deeper, many, many of us will be able to see Many of, many, many of us will be able to understand 
Because when this is known and you understand this secret, you move forward in a new way. I will also tell you how you can get to know this secret, the ways God reveals secret to us, and how this can be of help to you. I pray that our spiritual sight will be opened by force. Our spiritual sight will be opened by fire in the name of Jesus Christ. Whatever is blocking you from seeing what you want to see, whatever is blocking you from seeing the revelations that God wants you to see, may that thing be removed completely from your life in the name of Jesus Christ. Close your eyes and begin to talk to the Lord. Father, show me secret about my life. Show me secret of the bondage that I'm facing. Show me secret of this battle I am fighting. Show me secret why things are like this. Reveal to me the secret behind it. This secret is the key. This secret is the power of the enemy. When you get it, then you move forward. My prayer Thank you, Father. In Jesus' name, we pray. Get a bottle of water and a bottle of oil. Father, we thank you for this bottle of water and the bottle of oil. Let it be anointed. Let your power flow into this bottle of water. Let your power flow into this bottle of oil. Turn them to supernatural oil and supernatural water. Let your power of deliverance enter into them. In Jesus' name, we pray. Now you take the oil and anoint any part of your body. You can anoint your chest, anoint your head, anoint your hand, anoint your waist, anoint your legs. But when you are anointing them, you say like this, if you are anointing your head now, you will say, Holy Ghost fire, penetrate into my head and deliver me from captivity. If you are anointing your legs, say, Holy Ghost fire, penetrate into my leg and deliver my leg from captivity. You are anointing your waist, Holy Ghost fire, penetrate into my waist and deliver my waist from captivity. If you are anointing your chest, Holy Ghost fire, penetrate into my chest and deliver my chest into and deliver my chest from captivity. You take your time and pray on that one, two, two minutes on each of the parts that you are touching. Then take the water and drink a little. Aha. Uh -huh. Thank you, Father. Now I want you to get ready as we pray this prayer. This prayer we are going to pray will help you. I want you to pray very well with fire and with power. Say every hidden agenda of dark forces concerning my tomorrow scatter by fire in the name of Jesus. Every hidden agenda of dark forces concerning my tomorrow scatter by fire in the name of Jesus. Every hidden agenda of dark forces concerning my tomorrow scatter by fire in jesus name we pray beautiful aha uh -huh. so you open your mouth and pray the next one say any hidden personality in my dream that is increasing my problem be exposed and be disgraced in the name of jesus any hidden personality in my dream that is increasing my problem be exposed and be disgraced in the name of jesus any hidden personality in my dream that is increasing my problem. Be exposed and be disgraced. In Jesus' name we pray. Number three, say, oh God, my father, show me the secret of my life. In the name of Jesus. You have to spend five minutes on that. Oh God, my father, show me the secret of my life. In the name of Jesus. Oh God, my father, show me the secret of my life. In the name of Jesus. Oh God, my father, show me the secret of my life. In the name of Jesus. Oh God, my father, show me the secret of my life. In Jesus' name, you can take small part of the oil and put it on your eye a little bit. Aha. Uh -huh. Say, as you put it on the eye, lay your hand on your eye. Say, my spiritual sight receive deliverance in the name of Jesus. My spiritual sight receive deliverance. Receive deliverance. Receive deliverance. Receive deliverance. My spiritual sight receive deliverance. Receive deliverance. Receive deliverance. In Jesus' name, pray. God is going to open the eyes of someone to see a very deep, deep, deep mystery. Tonight, in the early this morning, as you go back to bed, God will open your eyes. You are going to see a lot of things. Aha. Go so get back to me if God reveal deep and secret thing to you. Oh, pray like this. Say, Holy Spirit, reveal the power source of my problem to me in the name of Jesus. Holy Spirit, reveal the power source of my problem to me in the name of Jesus. Holy Spirit, reveal the power source 
of my problem to me in the name of Jesus. Holy Spirit, reveal the power source of my problem to me in the name of Jesus. Holy Spirit, reveal the power source of my problem to me in Jesus' name. Pray. Spend five minutes on that prayer. Say, Oh God, my Father, deliver me from spiritual blackout in the name of Jesus. Oh God, my Father, deliver me from spiritual blackout in the name of Jesus. Oh God, my Father, deliver me from spiritual blackout in the name of Jesus. Oh God, my Father, deliver me from spiritual blackout in Jesus' name. Pray. Say, Any secret business taking place behind me be revealed and be disgraced by fire. In the name of Jesus, any secret business taking place behind me be revealed and be disgraced by fire. In the name of Jesus, any secret business taking place behind me be revealed and be disgraced by fire. In Jesus' name, we pray. Pray this last one for today. Say, any power hiding my true identity from me <laughs> be arrested by fire. In the name of Jesus, any power. I did my true as identity for me. Be arrested. Be arrested. Be arrested. Be arrested. Be arrested. Die now in the name of Jesus. Any power. I did my true identity for me. Be arrested. Be arrested. Be arrested. Die now in the name of Jesus. Any power. I did my true identity for me. Be arrested. Be arrested. Be arrested. Die now in Jesus' name. We pray. That prayer we have just prayed now uh, is a very deep prayer. Very very deep one that you need to take your time to pray. You might go back through this prayer. You might go back and take your time because it can take you one hour, two hours if you are very serious in the area of prayer. The Lord will open your eyes. The spirit of prayer will enter into you and you find out that a lot of things will come up. You can apply the prayer. You can stretch it. You can put some things there, situations. You have a new person in your house. You have a stranger. You are going to employ anyone. Many things like that. You put this prayer there. It will guide you into knowing what you need to know. The Holy Spirit is there to reveal secret to you. Contact him. He will show you. In Jesus' name we pray. Lord, we thank you for what you have done. If you have not given your life to the Lord, confess your sin. Tell the Lord to have mercy upon you. In Jesus' name we pray. Father, we are here before you. We present our prayer requests. Answer them by fire. Let there be testimony in our lives. I decree breakthrough into the life of everyone hearing me. In the level you expect breakthrough, career breakthrough, marital breakthrough, conception breakthrough, business breakthrough, financial breakthrough, examination breakthrough, I decree that you will receive it now, 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 in the name of Jesus. In the next three days, somebody will join us and share testimony. That shall be your portion in Jesus' name. Beloved, I can see the hand of God working upon you. Father, we pray for this country, Nigeria. You will, inter you will intervene. You will take control. As we are preparing for the election, Father, you will take control and let your will be done. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Beloved, God is working wonders and God will continue to do mighty, mighty things uh, in our generation. I pray that God will work wonders and use you in the name of Jesus Christ. You have a testimony to share? Feel free. Send your testimony across to me on this WhatsApp number 0802 336 9298. 0802 Three three six nine two nine eight. I fellowship at Mountain of Fire Miracle Ministry, and our international headquarters is at number thirteen on Lasimbo Street, Onike, Sabu Yaba, Lagos. It's just at the back of the second gate of University of Lagos, and ten minutes drive from Queens College. And our branches, our churches, are all over in the country and outside the country. Just you know, get anyone closer to you and ask them for help, they will definitely help you. I remain your good friend, Pastor Emmanuel Akiola. God bless you.